Hey guys, sorry for the video so close to the last one today, but um, I just had to um, show you a few more things I did right after the video. And also, I didn't have the macro function on on my camera, which allows you to film up close detail. And if you don't know what that is, and you make YouTube videos, just all you have to do is look for the button that has like a little flower on it and press that, it's called the macro function so yeah um, yeah you should be able to see it a little better and I think for the most part I finished this guy I didn't really have much to do today so um, I left the areas I had purple originally I left those purple because once I started adding the next um, skin color on their, or not skin, armor color. It was a little darker, and the red looked a lot better, which someone left a comment on, uh, saying pretty much the same thing. That the purple will probably look better with the, with darker red. Uh, I forgot who it was. Um, but, uh, for the most part, I just did it the same way I did my blood letters, a little different. Um... I really do like how it came out though. Uh, I like his eyes shine really bright. You know, I'd hate to have that thing coming at me. I decided to leave the trim black, just. I don't know, I, I like it better instead of purple. Because, um, I think that would be a little too much purple on there, so I, I like it with just those spots. And then I did the horn symbol yellow instead of brass because that's what I that's what I have on all my blood letters and all my other stuff so basically I just really wanted him to blend in with the rest of the guys but you know still look good so you know I think I think you can definitely tell that they're all part of the same army now there's that guy who's oh, that guy who's mostly uh, black with purple trim, and then they're mostly red. Um, they're mostly red with uh, some purple details and purple swords, and then oh. yeah, you can see it's a little, it focuses a lot better up close. And then also um, for the machinery, I just dry brush some bolt gun metal onto it, and then dry brush some. Or red, I think it was on that. So just um, I, don't know, I like how it came out. And I did that for yeah everywhere. Uh, it looks pretty close to the box, except um, obviously the purples and stuff, and there that highlight is gold or not gold. Uh, brass but um yeah the one thing the only problem i have with this model is it's got a lot of uh i guess you call flash on it oh, it's all the bumpy parts and it's really hard to get rid of on metal and you know you see this and it just looks so smooth right there um you see it just looks really smooth and then you know it doesn't really turn out that way it's you know actually you know has texture to it so but I mean it's still a really good model um, I really like the head part came up really well so I was pretty happy with that I just did that right after I finished the first video so I just gotta paint that guy on them and uh, everything else so yeah sorry for the video so close to the next other one I did but I just wanted to show you guys that and uh, thanks see you later